Very proud of Malik. Uh, 125 was loaded with studs. I mean, the kid he beat in the semifinals was a Division I transfer second semester as well, just like Eli Hale was uh, coming from Oklahoma State down to UCL. So for Malik to beat Portillo, at, who's now at UNK, that was a monster win. Very proud of him. But Josh getting here has been a real boost for the program. Um, there's something about that kid that's special that's always kind of had the it factor. Uh, he gets it. He knows what it takes to be a champion. And uh, it came to that uh, It came to that head, you know, this, this tournament. Battling. You know, I, I, we got some guys that weren't on our starting lineup that were beating kids that were wrestling here today on Saturday. So, uh, you know, the depth is coming around. Uh, we're excited about what we did tonight, bringing a trophy back to Fayette for our third D2 trophy. Um, some people might say we're back. You know, we never went anywhere, you know, but we're just, we're really excited about the future though too, that's for sure. Man, I, I give it to the guy. Uh, he's good. Um, and especially against me alone, he's made some, some serious improvements. Every time we wrestle, he seems to develop something new that I need to, you know, watch out for. So he's a great competitor. I take nothing from him and I suspect in the future he'll be a serious problem in whatever weight class he chooses to go to. But, uh, once again, um, confident in any position. Uh, I'm confident on my feet, um, confident in getting out, and I think that really showed, and that, that made the difference. Um, and, and you, you kind of look at uh, comparing the two, you know, he's, he's two out of the three positions confident. Um, he wasn't confident on getting out, and that's where I feel that I won the match. And I can't even tell you the amount of work um, from myself and everybody surrounding me. I'm 10 and a half hours away, and even my family, you know, they were working to get me to where I'm at. So it means everything. Um, not even just the national championship to be able to be here in Cedar Rapids with my you know, second family because I feel as if I've been adopted by this community around me. So to, I mean, the, the national championship, man, it's amazing. But uh, more importantly, to end my wrestling career. I've, uh, I'm 24 and I've been wrestling since I was six years old. Man, just to finish strong and finish on top, it's, it's a dream come true.